In this video, we are going to demonstrate the extraction of the microbiome from our bean beetles. First and foremost, we must make sure we have a sterile environment throughout the entire procedure. To do that, we sterilize our work surface and make sure that we are wearing gloves. The sterilization for our beetle are in tubes here. First, we want to prepare the tube that we will collect our beetle into. We have a mortar and pestle here, the tube. We will add 450 microliters of saline. This is the solution that we are extracting our microbes into. Now close this and set this aside. Now to sterilize our beetle, we have a wash station here. We're going to begin with bleach, then move on to water one, then ethanol, then water two. It's important to keep these waters in the direct, uh, this order so that the bleach is fully uh, diluted into the last step. We do not want bleach in our uh, microbiome plates. So to do this, we have our beetles that have been frozen for us and we have our tweezers. We want to sterilize our tweezers first by the same procedure that we sterilize our beetle with. So go ahead and open the tubes. And the process begins with bleach for three seconds. And it'll be good to have someone in your lab group timing this. And then move on to the water wash for 10 seconds. And then on to the ethanol for 5 seconds. And the final water wash for another 10 seconds. Once our tweezers are sterilized, we can collect our bean beetle. Make sure you have a good hold on the beetle so that you don't lose it throughout your wash. And the beetle goes into the bleach for three seconds. Give it a little swirl to make sure that the entire thing is coated. Now move into the water to clean off the bleach for 10 seconds. Then ethanol for five. And then water again for 10. Now our beetle is sterilized, and we can add it to the microcentrifuge tube containing saline. Now in the tube, we want to crush the beetle. It's not necessary to pulverize the beetle completely, but you want to make sure that the beetle has re uh, removed the contents from the beetle. So just squish up and down. You'll notice it becoming cloudy in color, your saline solution. Once you see that it's cloudy and you have harder pieces of your bean beetle, you are ready to go. Now, put dispose of this in your biohazard. And all of the pieces we want to collect at the bottom so that we're not plating these. So go ahead and centrifuge for just a second or two with the balance. Now that you've collected the large pieces of the bean beetle at the bottom, you can then extract your 100 microliters per tube of saline solution containing your microbes. Make sure you take from the top so that you are not collecting any of the large chunks of the bean beetle. Go ahead and plate these on your plates and we'll see what comes out.